Hello, my name is Greg Magucci, and I'm a technical marketing engineer. In this video, I'm going to show you how easily it is to take the generated SparkHair JavaScript code that you've created already and embed that code into your website. As you know, Cisco SparkHair is a formal omni-channel customer care service built on the Spark platform that seamlessly encompasses the customer interaction journey across communication channels. The service is easily accessible, allowing an organization to engage with their customers anywhere, anytime. Web chat as a service and callback is offered currently. If you're looking to sell products online but don't have a ton or any experience at web development or coding, don't worry. Shopify offers a comprehensive e-commerce web builder complete with hundreds of templates ready to go right out of the box. If you have one of these templates out of the box, I will show you how you can easily copy the Cisco SparkHair JavaScript code into your Shopify web pages. First, we will log into Cloud Collaboration Management and here we're going to navigate to the services and then click on care features. Here is a list of the care templates you have already created and this is where we can download the code to embed into our Shopify web pages. So I'm going to just click on download code and I'm going to go ahead and copy and paste this into a notepad for the next step. Once copied and pasted, I'll go over to my theme Shopify site and you can see I currently have two pages to choose from, the home and the catalog page. Now down in the right hand portion of my screen, above my date and time, you see that there's a bunch of blank space. This is where I want to have the floating Cisco SparkHair chat and callback option buttons. And I want them on both pages. In the Shopify admin portal, you can see under sales channels, your online store. If you go ahead and click on that, you're gonna expand it and you'll see themes, blog posts, pages, etc. We're gonna click on pages. From here, we're going to add page. We'll title it Spark Care. And then in the content section, you'll have to the right a show HTML tag. You're going to click that. And this is where you're going to go ahead and paste in the JavaScript code that we had already copied. We're going to mark this page as hidden and we'll click save. Once this page is created successfully, now we'll go to themes. And in the themes page, we're going to go ahead and edit the HTML, CSS. And in the base layout of theme.liquid, we'll scroll to the bottom. And after the last statement here, we're going to also paste in the code that's now going to reference the page that's hidden. And that's going to enable the Spark Care callback and chat. So I'll go ahead and click save. I will come back to my web page and I'll go ahead and refresh. And you now see in the bottom right hand corner, the callback and the chat options. And that will be on both pages. And there you have it, it was that simple.